Okay, now we're actually for real back this time. I was I had an issue there with the microphone, but today we're just gonna continue Mario World. Uh, are we on Mario? Yeah. Wow, look at that. We're 52. We have found 52 flagpoles. I, I don't like how you can't get to 100. I know it always bugged me as a kid too. It's flagpoles. There's like what 98. 96. N nice. Ugh, that's horrible. I don't like that. Makes me uh. Of OCD issues. <laughs> you know what's weird? Um, so yesterday I played on the iPad as my screen, and today I'm on like my regular big screen, and everything looks too big. <laughs> oh, you don't like that? Well, I'll just have to get used to it. Well, so yeah, bigger's better, honey. <laughs> it's not always the case in every situation. Sure it is. <laughs> Leave me alone, charging Chuck. Whoa. Today was an exciting day for me. I, uh, she let me, since my computer died, she let me buy a new computer. So I'm super, super stoked. And everything's running great? Yeah, my old computer, OBS would be about, oh, about 17 to 25% CPU use. This new computer, oh, about three. It's like, it like laughs. At a, oh, let's try that again. <laughs> Why did I come out of the pipe so slow? Is that? Yeah. Epic fail. There, oh. oh let's, let's try that again. We'll get it right this time. All right, one more try. One more time. There you go. That's hard. I think Yoshi was slowing me down. Yep. He was slowing me down. Slow me down. Gotta get off this crazy island. Got this crazy island. <laughs> Hello. We, have, we need to play Code Veronica. Yes, for sure. The game is so stupid, I love it. Me too. My controller's not working. Oh, maybe because we have a... Hold on a second. Alright. There we go. False alarm. We're good now. Almost got you. <laughs> I was going too fast. That ghost really doesn't like you. He does not. And it makes it hard because, dang it, I always jump in this game. Even when I'm not, like, needing to. Yeah, <laughs> you, like, looked at him for a second, like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you. The best Luigi is in the Mario Kart Luigi in Mario Kart 8 when he's uh gives you that look when he passes. Oh, you. I know. <laughs> I miss those memes. Those are fun. You don't see that anymore. No, that was fun. I miss playing Mario Kart. Maybe uh, soon you'll yeah. let me play it. Oh, going for the. I think that's the only way out. Remember the retro achievement where you have to get up there without using the ghost? Yeah. Do you remember what it was? I forgot. It's something silly. You had to like um, be Big Mario and like uh, this oh, into the ghost. Spin on them. It's like yeah. Because you can, you can spin jump on the mm -hmm. ghosts. I didn't know you could do that until no. Like, until we recently. were trying to get the achievements. Yeah. That's crazy, man. Yeah, the first half of the game was so easy. We could just like sit here. I was like talking my head off. I was in a really good <laughs> mood last night. Yeah. I was listening to my myself in the in post production or whatever, and I was like, "Damn, I'm talking a lot." <laughs> it's like, shut up. <laughs> the ADHD was kicking in. Right. See if you can keep Yoshi through this stage. I never can. I like how you can just jump on every one of them. You don't have to ever land. <laughs> well, apparently you do. Let's try that again. <laughs> right when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to be all cool. And like, we've already died like three or four times now. Oh, I know. That's not good. 
But we're just here to have fun. Yeah. We're not here to... Spit it out. At our age, it's like... We're in retirement mode. <laughs> we just want to sit back and if just I have die, fun. Yeah, I'm just going to rewind. I don't care. But. Final Fantasy XI feels like retirement mode now. It's, it's so much easier. I love it. You know, in a way, I kind of do too. I do miss the old ways, but oh, I don't know if I could do it anymore. Maybe if I didn't have a job and that's all I did, I can play the old school eleven. And like, well, I'm going to spend six hours this morning getting a party and then an hour to walk there. And then maybe when we get there, everyone's going to leave, so I have to get another party formed. And then uh, maybe and find I'll, replacements. Yeah, maybe I'll get a level tomorrow. Yeah. The best way to play 11 old school is have a static. Have a, like a, which is good. It encourages people to get friends. Every time we play old school, we always have like a several friends we always play with. Mm -hmm. And that's fun. Oh, it's the same place as you. Maybe this next round will be different. Yeah, I think you, you just have to wait. There you go. You did the same see, thing I did. I nearly always lose Yoshi at this spot. Get overconfident. I'm gonna wait till below 200. Maybe then it'll be a different level. Uh, I forgot the rules here. Me too. Yeah, it's different. Right, there you go. You're good. This is the one you wanted. Lots of mushrooms. I've died there a lot when the spring didn't work. Oh, me too. <laughs> Ain't that in the original Mario where the... I swear that oh, spring yeah. is a 50-50 chance. It's a 50-50. Sometimes it's a little jump, sometimes it's a big jump. I can never really get the timing just right. Nope. Ooh, you're doing Chocolate Secret today. Usually you do. Mm-hmm. We're going to change it up. Man, I love Yoshi. He's so Me stinking too. cute. <laughs> Yoshi's like what made this game a legend. Oh, for sure. Oh, crap, Yoshi, I'm just, I was just talking about how cool you are and... Crap. Not good. Not good. I lost Yoshi and my feather and my mush my flower. Oh, and he didn't get the halfway pull. Mario's feeling a little... <laughs> Ballsy today. I have died in this spot so many times. <laughs> From just doing this? Yes. How's that possible? Um, if you go too fast, like right there, yeah. you're, sometimes your butt will skip and those guys will, like right there. Oh. Like like that. And then they can oh. get you. And you're, you're like, you're a little and yeah. they smack you. Yep. How'd I do that? <laughs> After all that, I barely uh, brush up against that dude. Whoa! Charging truck almost got me. <laughs> yeah, so we started watching, um... X Files again for the fourth or fifth time. In our oh, life. I know. And what's so funny is that like um, we started watching X Files like day before yesterday, and then today like all the like all over X like all anyone's talking about is like the eight to ten feet tall aliens that were seen in Miami. Yeah. And so it's like, hmm, we picked a good time to start X Files. <laughs> Weird timing. Weird timing. Yeah. The first couple of seasons are so comfy. Oh, they are. I just love the theme song and like the the setting. It's all like gloomy and super relaxing music, and the oh, characters it's so are great. Chill. We haven't even got to the good stuff yet. We hadn't even seen. Oops. The first the first monster one's great. The the ant, Tombs? the the worm face. I think oh, the worm gosh. face is the first one that you see. He is. Creepy, like the stuff of nightmares. I remember, like it's been a while since I've seen it, but they took they take him, they catch him, they take him to court, 
<laughs> and they actually try to make him seem human, and he looks like a worm. Yeah. Like, how are you going to put that guy <laughs> on trial? On trial. <laughs> and Mulder's like, he's a monster. And, they, and their court's like, well, he's still a human. He's just mutated. <laughs> yeah. I get what they're saying, but Mulder's but like, no. no, the dude's like a monster. He's, he has no humanity left. No. I mean, look at him. Look at his face, man. It's just... Yeah, no. <laughs> he just wants to eat you. <laughs> I don't think he wants to get a job and pay his taxes and, you know, get his 401k. No. But one of my favorite episodes ever was the... Um, it was in, like, season 10 or 11, and there was a guy, and he was bitten by a human. He was a were-human. Like, he was a monster, and he was bitten by a human, and he felt like he needed to get a job and a 401k and, ha like, save up for retirement, and he was so sad all the time. <laughs> yeah, I think it's called Mulder and Scully meets the were-human. I think that's what it's called. Probably. And Yeah, that's a funny one. That's one of the few episodes I like in the new season. Pretty much anything that's not I liked all of mythology. Them. Oh, the mythology ones are bad. And the new ones. What? Yeah. Come on, you know they're bad. No, they're not. All the ones written by Chris Carter were pretty bad. They were not bad. I think they were? I, I enjoyed all of them. They were stupid. And it, they and it, weren't stupid. And they, they purposely awful. ended the show in a cliffhanger when they knew Scully doesn't want to come back. Well, yeah. I mean... The smoky man's dead. She's pregnant somehow with Mulder's baby. Yeah, they did They're that. They're gonna get married. Everything's gonna. It's gonna be great. It's not Mulder's baby. Remember, it was, it was revealed that it was smoky man's baby. No, William was smoky man's baby, but now she's pregnant with Mulder's baby. Oh, maybe. Yeah, for real. Unless Chris Carter messes that up too. I have no faith in Chris <laughs> Carter anymore. I know, because William was supposed to be Mulder's, and then they're like, no, it was the Smoking Man's. I'm like, what? I respect the man for making X Files, and I I appreciate that, but <laughs> I think the best episodes were the ones not made by him. Um, Like the, the Jose. Yeah. Something. I forgot the guy who did that. Um, um, he also did the Wear Human win. Yeah, yeah. All of his. And, and the Cockroaches win. Cockroaches. Win. Oh, yeah. dude, the cockroaches episode is one of my favorites also, because, like, so Mulder, like, keeps calling Scully, and he's convinced that there's, like, like, monster cockroaches on the loose, and she gives him, like, this, like, BS solution, like, oh, well, it's probably just this instead. Yeah. It's a perfectly logical explanation, and she's right, like, every single time. There really is nothing sinister. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. That's so funny. I, I love those episodes. I like the ones. I, um, I like the Vince Gilligan, the guy who made Breaking Bad. Uh, he got his start doing X Files, and his episodes are really good. Yeah, like uh, the one where Brian Cranston is in it. Yeah, it's called Drive. Yeah, and he like can't slow down, or his head will explode. That's what actually encouraged him to get him for Breaking Bad. After working with him, he liked his performance so much. Well, he did awesome. I really enjoy X Files. It really takes me back to when I was a kid. I watched it a lot. Um, I never saw it until I met you. I had never heard of it. It's kind of sad. Oh man, that was a great show, man. It was like always it on is TV. It's awesome. I love it. I never watched them in order. I always watched them whenever I just could see them. So I was I, I was always yeah. like a little lost. Like, what's going on now? <laughs> right. And so much wow. happens in the mythology. Like, so much happens. I know, so if you're behind on that, you're really confused. Yes. Like, Scully ends up getting abducted, and like... Yeah. And she gets cancer, and, and then she gets pregnant. Like, so much happens. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, it is. Mulder gets caught, like, I don't know how many times, and abducted. And he dies and comes back. <laughs> yep. A lot happens. I like the extra characters too. I always liked uh, Doggett and Reyes. I, I really liked them too. I, th I thought Doggett needed more. Mm -hmm. In fact, I thought that the, the uh, in the later seasons, the Monster of the Week episodes were the strongest, and they didn't have as many as them. Yeah, uh, they as, were awesome. I thought they were the best. One of my favorite episodes is the one where it's like the hills have eyes. Oh my gosh. I, All the mutant dudes. Or whatever. They're like cannibals or something. 
are you, are you talking about the creepy hillbilly episode? Yeah, the one that I hate? They keep the mother oh, under the bed. Yes. And she has no legs or arms. I hate that episode. You know, it was banned on really? TV. Because it, it was too sick. Too edgy? I like it, though. I don't. Like, so there's only two episodes of X-Files I don't like. I don't like the creepy hillbilly episode. And I don't like the, um, the, the one on Mars. The face on Mars. If that one's a cheesy one. I'm, I'm guessing Chris Carter wrote it. <laughs> I'm really dogging him tonight. <laughs> but, I mean, he's pretty awesome. He made X-Files. Yeah, but doesn't forgive the crap after season, like, I don't know, after season six or seven, the mythology got really... But Weird. when we when we watched it this last time, like two years ago, you enjoyed it. A lot of people actually think that after season two, the mythology starts going off rails, and everyone then everyone agrees that you watched X Files for the mytho- uh, monster the, of the week. The monster of the week, yeah. You don't. I think, you don't watch I it think the, you're being too hard on it. Well, I think everyone. I think everyone thinks, and I kind of agree too that once they started talking about black oil, it started getting off the rails a little bit, and then it got really off the rails. With the super soldiers and... And then Mulder decided he was too too cool for X-Files and he left and just the show got worse, worse, worse. But the, the, it still had know, talented man. writers, so some episodes are still really good. I don't know, man. Uh, like, the last time we watched it, like, you enjoyed every single episode Oh, I do. With I enjoy me. it. I'm just being honest here. Uh, sometimes you're too hard on things. Like... Well, maybe. Like, oh, after Mulder left, it sucked. I'm not, I'm no, not, I'm not dogging, awesome. I'm not dogging all the episodes. I'm talking the mythology episodes. They were good too. They weren't. They weren't. Too Every time the mythology good. comes on, I'm like, Ugh, all right, we'll just have to get through it. No. I'm waiting for the cool episodes. <laughs> That's just how I feel. I'm sorry. I just, I just didn't like the direction the UFO storyline went. Season one and two is awesome though. Bye, Trent Reznor. <laughs> <laughs> like, I love it when he like motors snuck on the base, saw the UFO, and got his memory wiped and like forgot everything. That was kind of cool. That was cool, that was, and that was in like episode two. That was the closest he got <laughs> to the aliens in two or three seasons, and he didn't remember a darn thing. Yep. Mario looks a little. A little, uh, special. obese. A little, well, especially with the cape on. Yeah, he looks, he looks a little it's overweight. It's his special cape. When, he, when, he's, when he's swimming. <laughs> he's got his swimming he's shoes. He's got his swimming shoes. <laughs> I don't like this level at all. No. You think you're safe and like that. I get you. Be alone, man. You know, if we actually played other games other than Super Mario World, maybe we could have, like, beat a ton of games we never played before. We just keep on playing this dang game. We love it too much. Well, we've played a, quite a, a ton. quite a ton of games, yeah. A ton. <laughs> we really have. On we've the walkthrough, a ton. on the walkthrough videos. Oh my god. At least 80, 90 games. Yeah. And I'm kind of, I got myself worn. Oh man. I wore myself out. Now I'm just going to do episodes. <laughs> I'll just play whatever I want to play. Not to really to beat it, just to have fun. Mm-hmm. I can't, I can't. It's like a job. I can't do it anymore. It's wearing me out, man. Some of these games are long, dude. Yeah. Suck on that. Yeah. Oh, I need the mushroom. Come here. I just hope they don't kill me. Oh, Ooh. like that. Oh my god, he looks so vulnerable, and his legs are like, oh, whoa! <laughs> I died there before. Yep, me too. Why is he spread eagle? <laughs> it's like we. He's a master at the splits. <laughs> Not me anymore. I like I was uh, hooking up my new computer and uh, running cables, and I um just kind of hurt my knee just bending down. Like, oh my god, I'm getting old. <laughs> Thank you. 
I want to start exercising again, but it's too dang cold outside. I, I like to jog, but go walking with you or whatever. And it's been cold for uh, quite a while now. Feels like a long time. And we're just, we just got started. Mm -hmm. It's January um, 5th. 5th. And winters here in the plains are pretty brutal. Oh, you're gonna fall in the hot chocolate. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty tired now. I expelled all of my energy hooking up that computer and running the cables and stuff. Oh, I'm tired now. Oh, I bet. I wasn't expecting to wake up this week and go, hey, my computer's broke. <sighs> right. Dang it. I had this funny feeling too this whole this whole week or the week before also. I started shopping like computer parts online and making builds and looking at prices and I didn't know if it's because I was I was just feeling the need. But it almost felt like I felt like I, like I needed to. Like it wasn't just as a desire to get a new computer. I feel like you know, I'm gonna need a computer here pretty soon. Right. I felt it coming, man. Is that how you were supposed to do it? Oh, I don't remember. I think there's a specific level you have to go in. Oh, right in the chocolate. Wasn't there a secret exit in one of the levels? I'm pretty sure there was. Um, I don't think it's a secret exit. I think it's the moons. Oh, and you have to get that for the, the achievements. Yeah, there was um, moons in every world. Yeah. I think the chocolate moon is in that one. You remember hunting them down, right? Yeah. I do. I do, I do, I do. You know what game I want to play right now? What's that? D. That one was fun. Um, That one puzzle, Uh, I had the first guide I had pulled up. It was like... Yeah, at the top of the tower, it's like a random amount of times you have to pull the button. Well, he was way wrong. He was way wrong. There's a there's a method to the mayhem. Yes. It was like 13 turns or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> but with those old games, sometimes you, like, one of the games that we played last week, I had to have five guides oh. pulled up. Five different tabs. Yeah. Five different guides. Because there, some of them are, like, obscure games that there isn't a really good guide for. You have to piece it all together yourself. <laughs> when we were playing Clock Tower, that girl, Maria, did it Marie. right. Marie. Marie, sorry. She did, an, did amazing an amazing job. job. Really, I mean, it's just like step by step. Yes. And Clock Tower is not the easiest game. Mm -mm. I think I'm supposed to go over this Down gap. Down there, yeah. I just cheated and flew across instead of doing the blocks. I can go up there, I think. There we go. There's a secret in here somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there's moons in your level too. Oh, man, I, I am the world's worst. Man. <laughs> hey. I got one. It's better than nothing. Oh. That's right. Man. Maybe I wasn't supposed to go this far back. Am I going? You're, back? you're right. Go across that gap. I can fly up there. Oh, not anymore. I forgot that you have to smash the blocks. That's okay. I got time. I saw Resident Evil 4 remake is on Apple uh, native now. We might want to play that again on our ma uh, mm -hmm. Mac. Um, what about 7 and 8? Uh, I don't know if they're on there. Uh, I think Villages. I don't know about... Seven. I don't know if that's probably a game you want to play on PS5 with me. Oh, this is the wrong way. Mm -hmm. Down there, Down green there, pipe. That's right. Whoa! <laughs> I would love to play seven again. Me too. The first part's my favorite. The third part is ugh. When you're on the ship, the boat seems to last oh, forever. It's like a different game. It is like a different game. I mean, it's not that bad. It's just. A, you have to know where you're going. Once you know where you're going, it's, it's a lot easier. But mm -hmm. I think I read somewhere that the game was divided like by three teams, and they're kind of working all at the same time. 
and they had different ways of how they think the game should go. The first part of the game is kind of supernatural. Mm -hmm. Second part's more like Resident Evil 1. Third part's more like a action Resident Evil 4 type. Like you're running as guns blazing and setting up mines and mm -hmm. It's kind of neat. It makes the game feel a little fresh, but once you get used to a certain way of the game playing, I don't know. I guess it depends on the person. I, I prefer the supernatural stuff. Yeah. Like the demo for Seven was awesome. It was awesome. And we treated it like it was PT, and we thought there was going to be more to it than like PT. Oh, yeah. And it, it, like, what's this mannequin's finger for? What's this for? Well, oh, maybe you have to like do it in a certain amount of time. You know, like we, we were trying yeah, to make the, it. Yeah, the whole it, world. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just got done playing PT and was amazed and thought, well, this is just like PT. I'm sure it's just like that. It wasn't. Yeah, it wasn't. They, they actually did a, a demo update <laughs> to add more stuff to it to make us happy. Because the fans were so like into it. Because Capcom was like, oh my god, they're like looking in this more than we realized. Because PT was so fun. Everyone like spent awesome. everyone spent days working as a team to figure out how to get the baby to laugh. And the whole time it was you had to plug in a mic. Yep. And just talk. And we played PT a couple days ago. And we got it to, win, to do it twice. Every time was because the mic. Yep. Without the mic, it's fine. It doesn't do anything. You just. I remember back in the day with the same problem. We spent days mm -hmm. going in that hallway, trying everything, looking at stuff. Find out you put the mic in, and boom, the baby laughs. Yep. It's over. That was the secret. But I think that we found new things this playthrough since we had a guide. Yeah, I think so. Like, I don't remember ever putting together the photograph, like finding all six pieces and it's, putting them It's together. not required, is it? No. It's just that you get extra, like, backstory. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. I enjoyed that. I'm really excited to see what OD is going to be like. Overdosing? <laughs> I guess it's going to be... I need Yoshi for that, don't I? Yes. Yeah, I don't know. It's, it looks like he's, he's going to make it kind of like Silent Hills. It's mm -hmm. going to be, which I, I, I'm i still disappointed. That it didn't come? Yeah, I'm a big Silent Hill fan, and I love the PT demo so much. Mm -hmm. Me so too. So much potential. Ugh. Yeah, I think he's so going to do like what he had planned with Silent Hills. Yeah. And maybe also... It seemed like there was going to be like some almost like Pontypool, that movie where like people started saying things and like, yeah. and it was like, it, and, like words lost their meaning and it almost became like a virus. The yeah. trailer seems like it's going to be kind of like that too. That's cool. So maybe. I like Pontypool. It was a weird movie. It's good though. It's good. I, uh, when I first watched it, I had my headphones on. I highly recommend uh, watching that with headphones on because it's such a video, it's an audio experience. It is. Yeah. I've never watched it with headphones, but I can imagine that that would be cool. I first watched it like, God, that was a long, that was a long, long time ago. Mm -hmm. I only saw 13 it 13 years ago. I watched it again recently and I had to put it on subtitles and lower the volume because I was, you know, in there and the, didn't want to wake anybody up in the middle of the night. It wasn't nearly as cool. You gotta have headphones. Yeah, I can't imagine watching that one like with low volume. Even better if you like watch it in VR <laughs> with your nice headphones on. I've done that before. It's pretty fun. It's called um Turn around. <laughs> you remembered. Oh, I got myself killed. <laughs> it's called a VR VR um something. Big picture? No. I think it is big picture. No, I think that's Steam. And um, you can watch movies in a fake theater. That's awesome. Awesome. Nice. Where are you going? We forgot to hit the blue switch. Oh crap. Oh yeah, on the right. I 
hate the forest. I'm just ready to get out of there. <laughs> there was one achievement where you had to go through this level and not touch the floor, the ceiling, or any of the walls. Oh, and I yeah. gave up and you did it. <laughs> that was awful, man. <laughs> that was freaking awful. It was one of the hardest achievements. Whoever thought of that is pure evil. <laughs> I always hit my head. I'm still haunted by it. <laughs> <laughs> it was hard even with cheats. Eventually I found out just turn the thing on where it will pop up or go away if you do hit the wall and then you rewind real quick. But without that, god dude, that'd take you forever. Even with that, it was still took quite a while. <laughs> it did, dude. <laughs> I started questioning myself, like, why am I doing this? <laughs> Must get 100%. It is really fun. I recommend retro achievements. It really pushes you to the next level. You think you're good at a game and you're really not. <laughs> good job. Thank you. I'm really tired tonight. I think maybe the beer might have... It was a bad idea. Plus not... you got up at 2.30 this morning. Yeah, I've been tired all day. I went to bed too. I went to bed like at 9. And I woke up at 2 just wide awake. I'm, you know, I'm going to cheat. I don't care. You can judge me. I don't, I don't, I don't care. <laughs> Alright, here I want to keep my my cape, okay? <laughs> I don't no care judgments. anymore. I don't care anymore. <laughs> like we've been watching The Office <laughs> with the kids at dinner time, and like we just watched the episode where, um, like Michael accidentally offended Oscar because he called him gay, and he was like, "But it, it's funny because he's not gay." And Toby's like, y "Yeah, yeah, he is." Like, <laughs> and he's like, "Oh." <laughs> That's a very awkward episode. <laughs> it is. It's so funny. Because he's he doesn't mean to offend anyone. He's just kind of ignorant. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. That's why I like the cape right there, so you can pull that trick. Yes. Whoa. Whoa. I think I cut off my butt hairs. <laughs> does Mario have butt hairs? <laughs> he's a plumber. Of course he does. It's almost guaranteed. Very nice. Now I'm already to the to the boss. You beat her out now and quit it if you really wanted to. <laughs> but I, be a back door in there somewhere. <laughs> I got a little bit more in me. Maybe twenty more minutes. You have to go back to work Monday. I know. Don't remind me. I was thinking about it earlier and got really sad. Oh. Uh, welcome to my world. I've been back all all week, even though I've spent most of it with you. It's been good. Mm -hmm. Too cold, though, man. Amarillo got some snow, but we didn't get snow. Uh, there were some flurries when we went to get lunch, but oh, okay. that was about it. It lasted for 10 minutes, and none of it stuck. They said it was going to be like an inch of snow, but it did not happen. Mm -mm. You have to have Yoshi. You better start select. You don't get Yoshi at all here? Mm-mm. Oh. <laughs> Just go to the next level? Yep, because you have to use the wings. No, you can still yes. beat the level without beating Yoshi. Yoshi's a different thing. Just to, just to go to the next stage, you don't have to have a Yoshi. You just don't have to go to the, the ceiling there. Oh, yeah. You just made me waste my turn because you just wanted to play more. I'm sorry. I did not mean to. I see how it is. Sorry. That's it. I'm asking for a divorce. <laughs> That's it. That's the last straw. Because I skipped your Mario turn. <laughs> yep. Can't take it anymore. <laughs> I'm taking the dog too. Oh, 
I see how it is. You know the kids, though. I don't care. <laughs> In the house, because you'll get stuck with the mortgage. Right. I'll be debt free now. And a lawyer starts laughing and rubbing his hands. <laughs> you wish, buddy. <laughs> I knew this girl in high school, even back then, 20 years ago. This, um, her mom had twins and they divorced this guy like an oil worker who had pretty good money it was like 2000 to 3000 a month in child, in child support that was back in those days dang dude that's like a ton of money back 20 years ago yeah nowadays $2000 is like meh you maybe can afford some McDonald's maybe <laughs> <laughs> things are so stupid expensive now we've lost so much buying power in the last couple of years. Yep. There is a Yoshi theme, but I don't... I forgot where it goes. It might be for a moon. Because I remember we had to do it for a reason. We did have to. Or maybe it was for the last Yoshi coin. It wasn't for a moon. It was for something for the achievement, but... Yeah, maybe it was for Yoshi coins. It wasn't for a path. Okay. I don't think. Um, I've caught up to you now. We've got every exit up until World 7. Really? We're yeah. just We're just speeding right along here. I guess cheating helps too, though. Yeah. I gotta do this again? Oh, that's the worst part about this level. Mm-hmm. Because be, it slows you down. It slows me down. <laughs> Man, I gotta sit here and wait. I know. Move it. Stupid ceiling. I got things to do, man. Anything fun happened today? Mm. Sitting at home, you know? No, I played 11 this morning, farmed some Dynamis, and then got my dancer from, I think I was level 80 Yeah. up to 89 today. Okay. I'm getting my dancer to 99 next, so that... Um, because if you go into the dream world of Dynamis and you lock sub job yeah. where you're only your main job and you don't have any sub job abilities, you, there's chances that you can get a 100 bind bill to drop. Mm, okay. And I need that currency because I'm going to try to build my very first relic. Oh, you're crazy. I've never had the uh, patience for that. Well, I love farming Dynamis. Like, it's one of my favorite things. So I thought I might as well, like try to get something cool. So I'm going to try. We'll which, see. Which weapon? I think I'm going to do the katana for ninja because I ninja's the job that I've been getting the best gear for. But I thought the ninja katana is like not the best. Oh, I haven't researched. Is it not? I don't think so. I might pick a different, different weapon then. You can if you want to, but I think a lot of people don't do that one. They do like the great katana and stuff. Well, my samurai is 99 as well um, and I'm fixing to have... Um, dancer at 99. I already have Thief at 99 and Black Mage. <laughs> <laughs> so I might do the Great Katana or the Dagger, because Dagger I could use for Thief and Dancer. It's crazy how the game's gotten to the point where now in in-game it's kind of you have to have one of those R-E-M- R-E-M-A- Rima. Rima weapons, yeah. Like, and you had to have a relic. That's crazy. Back in the day, people, very few people had relics. Yeah. Uh, it was rare. <laughs> There's like three per server, maybe four. Mm -hmm. Back in those days. Because it took like an ungodly, ungodly amount of time. Yeah. I don't know how people had the patience for it. I know. You have to have like, these huge link shells, and they're all like kind of helping you, and you can't, it's not enough resources to help everyone. Mm hmm. But now, I mean, you really can do it all by yourself if you wanted to. Yeah. Yeah, I might do Dagger, because then I could use it for Thief and Dancer. That'd be good. Yeah. Burr <laughs> round. Well, 
the sound effects. Me too. Aren't you supposed to go left? Um... I don't remember. You can fly up here, but it's tricky, remember? You have to do some crazy stuff. Oh, I'm not that. doing that exit. You you always can do it. I have to cheat like crazy, but I can do it. I'm not good to get the thing. I don't think it is left. It's left. I know it is. I'm the one that always does this level. <laughs> you better hurry. That was close. And fly up there. I think. Yeah, no. It's not left. It's right. But you have to, like, oh. stop. I should have got that Yoshi coin. Well, maybe, maybe left I was thinking of the key. Yeah, it's like all the way to the second door, I think. I can get that one. Yeah. I could try going for the key, but I don't know, man. That's, that's a tough one, and it's kind of embarrassing how often I have to cheat. <laughs> well, it is a tough one, but we've gotten every exit in the game up until here, so... We have? Yeah. I thought we missed one, like, in the jungle, for sure. No, I went back to the forest and got it just now. I guess you can watch me cheat the crap out of this. Yep. Let's do this. <laughs> the best way is to send that thing up there, make it blocks. I'll try that first. And remember, you can control it. With the D-pad. Am I going the right way? You were supposed to go left for this. Let's go. Let's back up. Yeah. Hold on. Let's back up. Where is it? Keep going. There you go. I don't have the P. Dang it. I screwed up, didn't I? I'm supposed to bring a P in here from the other side. Oh, yeah. You'll have to do it that way then. Let's see if I can... Got oh, it. Oh, oh. You can do it. You can do it. That ghost is going to give me. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I've I, never I cheated been able a little bit. It's, it's the funny, lazy man's way of doing it. I've never been able to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. I felt the pressure there. Well, this is one of my favorite levels. Glad I get to do it. Even though when I cheat, I never feel like I should reward myself, but it's still fun. Yeah. It's just a game, man. Have fun. Some of these older games are stupid hard, too. Especially if you want, like, all the achievements and stuff. Oh, especially. And all the exits. For me, it's just beating the damn thing. That's an achievement in itself. I can't imagine making it even harder than that. Most of the uh, Nintendo hard games is what they call it. Nintendo hard. <laughs> I don't know if they just thought that people want to get their money's worth. The game can't be too easy. Right. Maybe they're just trying to figure things out still. Who knows? But they were freaking hard. This is my companion spring. <laughs> Well, it's not a very good companion. It's not a very good companion. Got you killed. <laughs> Let's try that again. Oh my god, babe. This is embarrassing. <laughs> okay, the spring's gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why are you taking the spring with you? I don't know. For added difficulty. Well, apparently it worked. You just couldn't, you couldn't fly. Nope. Couldn't hang with that. A star road. Mm -hmm. I was looking at your wallpaper. I want to watch. I want to watch Shaun of the Dead again. Me too. Yeah. Um, I've got like a ton of wallpapers. Let me see how many I have. And I just have it on like shuffle every thirty minutes. I had it on my computer before it died. Rest in peace. 
I saw like Dark Souls poster. That's all I had for years. Just I have 158 wallpapers. Dang. And it cycles. On the new computer, I just have it on default. I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I might customize it later. <laughs> Who knows? So relaxing. Mm hmm And the music is just it's so nostalgic. That's the best. You don't get much better than Mario, man. I like new games too, but I don't know, man. Just can't beat good old Mario. Yep. Someday we're gonna have to go back to Mario Wonder and try Star Road because we never even attempted it. We were just like so done. It took us like 15 hours to beat the game, and by then we didn't want to do Star Road. We're pushing it too hard. Yeah. Trying to beat it in one weekend. Yep. Where's the magician? Oh, there he is. I killed him too fast. Magic Koopa. They forgot him in the credits. They totally did. But they fixed it in the Super Mario World Game Boy Advanced version. Yeah, I think I actually credited them. Yeah. <laughs> Mushroom. Don't get hit by the sharpened pencils. <laughs> <laughs> I've always thought that too. Maybe I can get in there. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Appreciate you. Much obliged. <laughs> Nice. That's going to come alive. I'm looking. Hey, what was that about? <laughs> I hit him with that. Yeah, you did. But it like went through him. It went, yeah, what the heck? Not cool, man. Oh, let's mess around. With, oh, what the heck? Why did I... I thought the thing was far, far enough over there. Oh, crap. <laughs> No, don't play with him, not honey. I know, right? <laughs> That's what you always tell me. You always do that. You always play with him. <laughs> what am I doing, man? I'm, I'm just, like, so tired of that. There get, you go. Get your ass in... In the tomato soup. The tomato sauce. I hate or tomorrow's. Whatever. I hate to cheat this much, but when you're tired, you're like, fuck it. I'm just gonna rewind. <laughs> Thank you. Man. Mario's strong. Almost ready for Star Road. Almost. Yeah, I'm not sure what we'll play this weekend. I'm not sure. I was thinking maybe a newer game. I don't know. I would like to play 14. I don't know about that. I'm kind of. 14 and 11 out. I'm just tired of MMOs. Yeah. I tend to like just dressing up my character more than actually playing it. <laughs> Isn't that sad? A little bit. I should just play The Sims at this point. As sad as that is. I'm just tired of the monotony in that game. It's been the same gameplay loop since forever ago, 2010. Right. Your gear's like... Nope, I have to have Yoshi for the thingy. There's an update, your gear's outdated, you farm the gear, there's a weekly lockout, and then repeat. It's old. Eleven was kind of like that too in a, in a way, but it was, it spiced it up just enough to where it was fun. I never get bored in 11. Uh, I, I do. 
one of the achievements was in this level, and you couldn't touch the flagpole in the middle. And it made it oh, for like, yeah. remember, it was like a really hard jump not to touch it. Yeah. <laughs> that was a creative one. Mean, though. This is actually a pretty hard level. Nope. What are you trying to do? I have to have Yoshi at the end. Well, that's not how you keep Yoshi right there. Why don't you just ignore it? Just run past it. There you go. Oh, you need the you need the, the tongue. Yep. To reach in there. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded dirty. <laughs> hey, you made it dirty. That was on you, not me. <laughs> I can't go left. Oh, never mind. I can, I can you go, can go around. <laughs> tired butt. <laughs> dude, I, dude, I am so tired. No, I'm sorry. I can't I, go left. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> gotta go home now. Gotta go to bed. I don't know if I can make it to Star Road, dude. It's okay. I didn't realize how tired I was. It's only like 7.40. <laughs> it's sad. It's okay. Oh, crap. Sorry. <laughs> Whoa, that was close. Uh, and I died. It's a um, hard level. It is hard. I don't mind cheating. No. <laughs> yeah, that jump right there. It's really hard to not yeah, what, get the goalpost. I can't jump on the ball? No, only if you have Yoshi. Oh. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> That's just me being stupid. Just e forgot to jump. E yeah, easily avoidable. Whoa. I used to die nice. here so much. Oh, me too. Me too. It's embarrassing. I've died a lot at that level. <laughs> This one just fly out. This is gonna be hard to beat first time. Mm, well, maybe not. Yeah, up and then right. There you go. Make a good pathway to fly up there. Mm -hmm. It should be good. Get ready to fly. Right, right now. Go, 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 go. Oh, you screwed it up. You suck. That is not nice. I even told you you need to fly. You didn't listen to me. Well, we have to beat it both ways anyway. That's last time I give you advice. You can still make it if you fly right here. It's, it's trickier, but you can do it. I've done it before. There you go. Ooh. Um, You're going to have to fly left, I think. I've done it like before. Oh, then, yeah. Then Yoshi. Exactly. That's, that's how I did it. I remember doing that. Yep. I Good remember job. doing Good that. Job. Cool. With, without Yoshi, you probably would have to do some crazy backwards flying tricks or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have to beat it normal, right? Yep. Shit, why did I do that? <laughs> Why did you do that? What? The, don't quit grabbing it. I don't know if your pathway's gonna be long enough. I don't know if your pathway's gonna be long enough. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? I don't know. <laughs> Use your imagination. Okay. Good job. I'm doubting me. And no, no, go get him. Go get your yellow Yoshi. Feed him. Feed the Yoshi. Feed the Yoshi. Well, I'm in a hurry. You're thinking, I, must go to bed. I'm late tired. <laughs> late tired. Then fires and missiles. 
<laughs> there we go. Very nice. There will be other Yoshi opportunities. That's true. I liked the achievement of how you had to use the specific color Yoshi to stomp on the switch. Like you had to use a blue Yoshi and go do the blue switch and a yeah. green Yoshi and go do the green switch. Like that was cool. That was kind of creative. Yeah. I like that too. You had to get to Star Road as quickly as possible so that you could go do all the switches. Yeah, we really had to think there, didn't we? Mm -hmm. During the retro achievements. You just stay right the whole time. You're too far right. Oh, never mind. You're good. I remembered what never to mind. do. <laughs> I didn't know if it was you have to hug the wall or not. But it seems like you know what you're doing. Yeah. Not our first rodeo. <laughs> no, go back. You have to do it the right way. For flight poles? Yep. Oh, we're still doing that? Yep. Gotta get that 96%. <laughs> Even though it's not a percent, but it should be. I always thought it was. Nope, just flight poles. There should have been a hundred, dang it. There should have been. They got lazy and didn't do four more levels. Yeah. Or just two more levels and beat it two different ways. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, nice. nice. I love doing that. It's so fun. Get him. Oh, no. Get him. There we go. <laughs> nice. nice. That is so fun. It is fun. <laughs> but they have fun programming that. Mm hmm. I just walked back. <laughs> Good job, Mario. I like how stars like immediately grow them up. Oh no 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 no! No, bad Yoshi. No, fine. Bad Luigi. <laughs> Blaming Yoshi for your suckiness. <laughs> It's not right. Man, I just had a really stinky fart, man. Well, why did you feel the need to share? Oui. <laughs> that fart was so bad, the dog oh would leave gosh, the room. Oh my gosh, I can smell it all the way over here. Yeah, I warned you. <laughs> We're all the way across the room from each other. The dog ran away. The, the cat's like, peaced out. If we had one. <laughs> flower just died. <laughs> like in Supernatural when death walked by and all the flowers died. <laughs> yeah, that, that was that, man. Woo -wee. <laughs> Must have been a turkey fart because we had turkey tonight. <laughs> That's your fault. <laughs> turkey fart. <laughs> <laughs> turkey fart. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh, whew. Ooh, good job. I got hit at the same time because I uh, I was blinking. Yeah. So I should have died, but Yoshi saved me. Yoshi's a bro. And the blue one looks really cool. He does look cool. Red one was always my favorite, but blue one's cool too. They're all cool. Ooh, you chose an odd path. Mm. Right through them. I'm always choosing odd paths in my life. You went, you went to the down way already, right? Yeah. Got it.
Okay, this is the hardest one to get for the normal flagpole. It's just, oh, you're done. There's that one game we forgot to get the flagpole here, remember? What are you doing? You could have flew up there. I wanted to keep Yoshi. You can, you can fly on there with Yoshi, can't you? In the cloud? Yeah. I tried to, but it wouldn't work for me, oh, so maybe, I just ditched it. Oh, uh, I thought it let you. Yeah, that, that one we have forgotten the flag before. Hmm. Yeah, that's funny too. It's easy. And it's like right there. We, we went to <laughs> Just every go level. Touch it. We went to every level going, did we do this one? Did we do this one? And it was like this one right here was yep, the one we that forgot. Was it. <laughs> and it's easy to lose one, lose track of one. It is. It's like, well, we have 95. Which one do we miss? Yep. All right, one more. Well, twice. The good news is the awesome levels. Have to beat them once. They have one, yeah, they only have one pole. But they're a little difficult. Not too bad. I bet Yoshi would kick ass at a hot dog eating contest. <laughs> totally. <laughs> the best thing about Yoshi is that he wears shoes. <laughs> well, yeah. Saving my blue Yoshi. Yeah, I don't blame you. You have to go across that? You have to fly under it. Oh, oh, yeah. I think you're right. Oh, you screwed up. Try again. No? What's the secret way? I guess that was not the case. I forgot. <laughs> huh. I forgot too. Hmm. Maybe it'll come back to me. Uh, let's try again. Is it a pipe or something? <laughs> that's, not, that's not the way to do it. Maybe you have to fly up or something. But didn't you do that? I flew up, yeah. I won't do that this time then. I think the red one flies faster than does, the blue one. Does it? Looks like you're flying faster than I was. That's right. I think it's in here. Oh, it's down there. Down there. You're going to abandon him? Whoa. That was nice. Oh, yeah. You're not going to be able to eat the shell as him, though, because he'll spit it out as fire. I have to ditch him. Yep. You could go back for him. Shit. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> that shell just like appeared out of nowhere. Just screw me over. Oh, bye, Yoshi. So I guess when you're flying around, you just totally bypass just, that. Yeah, missed it. But you got the you got the bad or the normal, whatever. So we're good now. We can go to awesome, awesome world. Or special. Special, yeah. I wonder if you eat that turtle from across the oh. thing. I don't think you can, though. No. You might, well, you might be able to. I don't think so. Wow. What? How'd you die? How did I die? That's weird. That was weird. You got stuck in between the wall. 
glitched the game and it killed you. <laughs> I've never seen that before. I've never seen that either. Nice jump. Why, thank you. Are you afraid? Are you hiding your head? And you still, you still got hit. <laughs> Poor thing. <laughs> Smash all the peas. I can't wait till your gift I bought you comes in. <laughs> My random Me too. $400 gift that is just on the on a whim. Like, I know it's already past Christmas, but I'm, you deserve another gift. <laughs> because one of the gifts I got you from China did not make it. It got lost in the mail, and I felt kind of bad, so I wanted to give you a, a proper gift. Well, I'm really excited. I can't wait to see what it is. I felt so bad your gift never came. I mean, I got you some other stuff, but... Above and beyond this one. <laughs> I can't talk about it though. I want to so bad. We'll talk about it when we uh, open it. I don't think it's shipped yet. Is it from China? No, it's from. That's good. This is made in the States. Because we have not had good luck with Chinese shipping lately. Well, it was my fault. I accidentally, uh, on eBay, I put the old address. Is it this one right here? Yep. No, it was the other football man. It was? Yep. Oh, my bad. Very nice. I never liked football because of these guys. That's what stemmed my hate <laughs> for football. That's why. So it's not that, so that bad. I mean, I, I die there so much. Oh, me too. It feels worse. Mm -hmm. You think you have to go a lot further, but it's really not that bad. I've died a lot there. Oh, me too. A lot. Um, one of the achievements was beating that level without using a P. So I, you had to like fly through the whole thing. Yeah, it I was hard. I didn't even know if it was, it was even possible, but it is. It is possible. It is possible. It's crazy, man. <laughs> this level's pretty tough. Yeah, it is. Oh, we should have stayed up. Nah, keep it. Yeah, leave it. Oh. No. Oh, uh, no. Are you sure? Yeah, because it's going to go back around in a circle. I think that down there might be a drop-off. We'll see. No, you're right. I think the other one's drop-off. You go, you go like up and around, then drop off, maybe. Yeah. That was if I have Yoshi, which I don't. Oops. You cheater. Oh, I don't even care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're tired, it's late. We don't care anymore. <laughs> You would think teachers would be strictly anti-cheating, but when it comes to Mario, I don't care. Or any game. <laughs> or any game, yeah. Well, mostly retro games. Yeah. New games are kind of easy. You don't really need to cheat anymore. <laughs> Unless you're playing Dark Souls. Oh, I would never cheat on Dark Souls. That's just, you have to get good. Yes. There's ways you can exploit the game, though, and make it easier for yourself. played Dark Souls in a while. I know, I'm ready to play again. I think we beat it a couple months ago. Just the first one. I haven't played Elden Ring in over a year. Maybe longer. Did that come out in March of... No, no. Um, we played right before we moved, like five months ago. 
Um, because I was stuck on the final boss and I beat it and we started at like new game plus three or four and yeah. we were like, this is way too hard. Like <laughs> we, we played for a little bit, but we didn't play play since the game came out like in March of like, yeah, God, it's almost been two years already. That's wild. Oh, the achievement for this one was you had to beat the entire thing as tiny Mario. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's, that's harder than it sounds. <laughs> well, the hardest one was not touching the ground on the level coming up. Mm -hmm. That one's oof. And touching the walls and that um, water. The swimming one. Yeah. Oops. Almost. Oh, God, not the fish. I'm cheating, too. Uh, I don't know if I can get that without getting hit. No. <laughs> I'm sliding. Oh, make it stop. <laughs> make it stop. It's slippery. Yeah, this level was really hard as Tiny Mario. God. Oh, I remember. I think I beat it. You did. I think you did all the ones, all the achievements in Super. They were just too hard for me. It's pretty crazy, the achievements. Fun, though. I recommend doing them. Four more levels. We can do it. I love how Yoshi's drums that plays with every track. Mm -hmm. This is the one you gotta fly and never touch the ground. Yes. The trick I did is I went in the world and I ate everything I could. And then I quickly, because you had to go really fast, you ran, you ran out of time. I barely had enough time. I think some things respawn. Mm -hmm. I don't think the plants do though. Or I might have that backwards. Oh, nice. No. Nice combo eat there. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, bro, bro. <laughs> yeah, I poop clouds. That's a Yoshi thing. You wouldn't understand. Yeah. You poop happy clouds. That's right. That drop coins. <laughs> Girls don't poop, they poop clouds. Kinda like the North Korean dictator. He doesn't right. he doesn't poop. <laughs> he tried golf once, hit a in hell of one and it's too easy and he decided not to play ever again. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm determined to keep my stuff, because these levels I, dang it. You're you're fine. He's he's throwing so many baseballs at you. There. You'll I live. knew I could do it. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy person. You crazy goose. <laughs> I am so tired, man. I'm hanging in there. Three, three more. I can do it. I wish there was like some like unknown Easter egg that no one's ever found before and we found it on accident. Oh, that'd be so cool. Oh, this level's hard. Yeah. Don't judge me. I'll be cheating a lot. <laughs> <laughs> like the first video, the first half of the game, we didn't cheat like once. No, we didn't need now to. We're, and now we're like, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> this, is not, this is not going good. What are you what are you doing, Mario? Mario! I, I blame him for my crappiness. That's hard right there. He's like, Mario, yep, it's what hard. What are you doing? <laughs> it's hard, yep, 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 it's hard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
I'm sick of these fish. I like how they can't hurt you on land. You just run into them. Oh, you can? Yeah. Oh. I'm still afraid. You're still afraid. <laughs> Like, let me out of here. <laughs> oh my god, I know. This level hurts my head. It's all you now. Oh, I liked how the achievements made me go to Bowser's castle, castle and actually explore most of the castle that I haven't really been in. We had to do every single level. Usually cool. I just do the back door. Yeah. So you had to like do like one and four and then die. Yeah. And then do doors two and five and then die like we had to it, it was it was neat yeah you really had to explore the entire game outrageous yeah, this is a hard one mm -hmm. if you have yoshi though you can just like boost jump yourself past that last big cannon gun That's not a good start. There you go. You can do it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking I'm doing right there. Yep. Because it kind of sucks having to jump off the cannon shells. The bullets. Oh yeah. It's hard. It's no. hammer time, bitch. <laughs> You're gonna hide over there in the corner. Leave me alone. Okay. Was that your hammer strategy? Hammer bro has got to go. Hammer <laughs> bro's got to go. <laughs> That's my campaign slogan. <laughs> <laughs> we are anti-hammer bro party. <laughs> this is really embarrassing. <laughs> It's really sad. We probably shouldn't be recording this. This is how you do not play Mario. <laughs> I did it! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Took 20 tries. Funky. Oh, cool. Look at my background. It's one of the new ones I got. The little seven. A little flashy, huh? It's James Bond. Yeah, I said that. <laughs> What's in this one? There we go. What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> <laughs> What's that doing there? I'm gonna blame my controller on that one. <laughs> that one too? <laughs> yep. That's a hard jump. It is a hard jump. Oh, he can't hit it. He has a horn in his head. For some reason. You can't use firepower against them. Nope. And remember, this one has a short time limit. Yeah, I know. You need a haul ass. This is the one that's hard too. You have to beat this it. This one's really hard. In retro treatments, you have to beat it like even faster. Remember? Mm -hmm. I was having a haul ass. You have to beat it like in 110 seconds or something. And I, would, I, would, I would have already failed. Yeah, oh yeah. And if you have Yoshi and you eat all the green apples, you get extra time. Which helps. Which helps. I think you had to. You had to. Or you don't make it. Yeah. Did I knock one of them down? I think you did. You are... A, a cheater. Super player. <laughs> I'm chasing, or cheater. I'm chasing my fireball. <laughs> and one more. Bowser Castle and we're done. Mm -hmm. We've beaten Mario for the first time of the year and it's probably going to be the first of many. Right. This is the game <laughs> we always come back to. Thank you. 
Did we, did we unlock all the star paths? Uh-huh. I think so. And that's gonna be the closest way to get back to Bowser. Make sure I have two feathers. I was about to say, you can't take Yoshi with you. Nah. He's afraid of castles. And ghost houses. Yeah, too spooky for him. Should be a bottom right one. All right, Ouija. Let's do this. <laughs> Help, Ouija. <laughs> You gotta turn on your disco ball. It's time to get funky. <laughs> I like Mecha Koopa. They come back in the new one. Didn't they? Yeah. A lot of things did. And in Mario Odyssey. I love Mario Odyssey. That's a good game. I would like to watch you play Mario Odyssey, and I'll like have a guide pulled up with like all the moons, so you can get all of them. Ooh, yeah, that'd take forever, dude. It would. Could but though. It'd be, it'd be fun. Cause it, um, I tried like playing and having a guide pulled up, and it's too hard to do both. Yeah, that, that's most games though. It's, it's nice to have someone that will read for you. Mhm. Mm and tell you like, hey, look, right there is where you need to go. Yeah, and not get mean about it. Right. Like you to me sometimes. You're like, what are you doing, dumbass? Um, what? I said to go that way, you I, loser. I, <laughs> that, that has never happened. <laughs> Off the stream, yeah. You bet your ass. What? You're so abusive. <laughs> you start hitting me and stuff. You need to stop that, man. You're crazy. It's not nice to hit your husband. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He looks a little derpy. A little bit. The Mecha Koopa? Mm -hmm, yeah. yeah. Watch out. Oh, good job. You're hitting him like really crazy places. Usually I like aim over his head and drop on him, but you're doing a pretty good job hitting him straight on. Thanks. I don't know if you're planning to do that, but he's done a pretty good job so far. Oops. No. No. I hexed you. No. <laughs> now you're stuck in. He's, he's, he's got you trapped. <laughs> he's got me trapped. You're gonna have to, like, duck or something. There, there we go. go. It's like Edge of Tomorrow. You just keep on... <laughs> Live, die, repeat. That's right. Repeat the cycle until you get it right. <laughs> Uh, I recommend hitting over there. You go. There you go. Hey, I have shot. beaten this game so many times. I got this. <laughs> you and your damn trick shots. <laughs> hey, help. <laughs> help. Like she didn't mean to get kidnapped. <laughs> yeah, you know she's... It's a conspiracy. I think Mario's starting to catch on. Ooh. That was mean. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. You beat it. Yeah, we beat it. <laughs> oh, I gotta look up. I'm holding, I'm looking up. Let's see if you'll do it. Yeah, if you didn't know, if you hold up, like you're looking up in the air the whole time during this, during the cutscenes, he'll kind of like start nodding up and down like... He'll be dancing. Yeah, it's not really dancing. It's mostly like nodding, but sure. <laughs> they say dancing, but... I like how I didn't mention Luigi. Yeah, it's Mario and his friends. <laughs> but like in the Game Boy Advance version, if you beat it as Luigi, it'll say, thank you, Luigi. Like, <laughs> yeah. Poor Luigi, man. 
He never gets any love. I know. He's always been my favorite, though. Every time we play Mario together, I'm Luigi. Yeah. Good job. I did it right. Yeah. See, he's kind of like See? flapping his arms. He's and dancing. <laughs> it's a pretty cool Easter egg. What's funny, though, is that like if you look up how to make Mario or Luigi dance um, during the end credits, some people are like, okay, you have to hold up, down, left, right, and all of the shoulder buttons and like all the things. All you have to do is hold up. Like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it would still work. But the key button is up. Yeah. You hold all the buttons down if you want to. If you want to, but you just have to hold up. Yeah. I wonder how many times we've beaten this game now. A hundred? <laughs> A lot. Yeah. Especially, I mean, because both of us have played it our whole lives. When did it come out? Like, 92? Yeah. I was five. 90, actually. Okay, well, I probably didn't get it until I was, like, yeah. five. I like how this is, like, the only company that really had their real names. Mm-hmm. Other companies had fake names because they are afraid they are going to get poached. But Nintendo's like, well, we know, like, this is the... <laughs> we're awesome. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're high in the totem pole. No one's going to leave us. Mm-hmm. I love how loyal Japanese companies are. I wish it was that way in the States. Yeah company taking care of you. Now the only way get, the only way to get a raise now is if you get fired and come back or leave jobs. I got let go and came back and had a huge raise. <laughs> yep. I like his mailbox. <laughs> it's really cute. I like all the baby Yoshis. Having a fireplace under a tree just seems really dangerous. It does. You just love the amazing Flying Hammer Brothers. <laughs> They're a favorite. No. <laughs> Monty Mole. I like how it shows the alternative monsters since we beat the extra world. Me too. Dino Rhino. <laughs> Mask Koopas. It's so cute. And, their, and their wife beaters. <laughs> He's a little derpy. <laughs> Torpedo Ted. And I always wondered, like, where I, is I he? Know why we've never seen Torpedo but Ted? He's only in one spot. He's only in Soda Lake. Yep, that's it. The whole, the only place in the whole game. Yep. And Soda Lake is really hard to find unless you know where it is. Yeah. <laughs> we always skipped it on accident. Didn't know it was there. Swamp. And thwimp. And thwimp. <laughs> <laughs> Ball and chain. <laughs> and then Trent Reznor. Of course. <laughs> I want to fill you from the inside. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> then that song just like make you feel dirty just listening to it I wanna peep you like an animal <laughs> the end question mark well that was fun that is his actual name I was seeing if maybe he made it a stage name and like was a Mario reference but no that's his real name who Trent Reznor <laughs> oh, oh, that's a cool name. I was like, what, what are we talking about here? <laughs> Keep up. You lost me. Well, thanks for watching. That's That concludes our Mario. Um, we're going to play games at random, so we might not beat some games. We may come back to beat them later, but games like this, I'll definitely come back to beat. We'll play another. I'm not sure we'll play tomorrow. Who knows? Whatever we feel like. I feel like playing D. It's that. It's a, it's a um, PS1 horror 
kind of survival horror, kind of it's like mist, kind of. It's fun. gameplay. Yeah, I always like it. It's really short, but there's a lot of puzzles you have to solve, and the, some of the puzzles aren't very clear. But it's it's a it's a good game. It's nostalgic to me, so I may play that. I'll I'll think about it. But yeah, sounds good. Thanks for watching.